Podcast. Ron Paul's visit to Minnesota on the eve of Super Tuesday brought a wide range of voters to the University of Minnesota's North Paul. The rally's total numbers were on par with Hillary Clinton's recent rally at Augsburg. While most Democrats remain focused on the Obama-Clinton horse race, perhaps the most neglected story of this election is the mass movement of defiance in the GOP's base. Add up all the Paul votes from all the primaries we've had, and you can see that Paul presents a much larger problem for the Republicans than Ralph Nader was to the Democrats in 2000. I come, I come here tonight because I heard there were more than three dozen spammers in uh, Minneapolis. We now, we now have an empire some won't admit it, but we do. If you have 700 bases outside our country and around the world, that means we are maintaining an empire. We do not need an empire. You know, old people in government, Star Wars, young people have to fight them. And it's not fair. Our campaign received more money from active duty military people than all the other candidates, including the Democrats, put together.